And now, ladies and gentlemen, I have a special surprise for you, Mr. Richard Halpern. I've received a telegram, ladies and gentlemen, from our special guest who couldn't be here tonight, Sybil Jason. She's a bit under the weather, and it's her birthday, and we wish her all the best. She's in at home right now watching the show being broadcast live. And she sent this telegram to you, Richard. She sent it? What does it say? To Richard and all of my showbiz friends. Thank you so much for your wonderful birthday greetings. Richard, you did a wondrous job on I'm a Little Big Shot Now. Couldn't have done it better myself. May I wish all of you and your loved ones a bountiful and happy Thanksgiving. Blessings sent to all of you as ever, Sybil Jason. Yay! Thank you, Sybil. I just received the telegram. It came from Sybil. Amazing! A it's, telegram boy came and brought it a in? A telegram boy came and delivered to me, ladies and gentlemen. She's been watching the broadcast tonight by means of Electronic Television and the Dumont Television Network, who makes it all possible to bring you this fine show. And now, ladies and gentlemen, it's time for more music with Richard Alpern and the Hollywood Cavalcade. Thank you, Max Weltemill. And you know, tonight we're celebrating Al Jolson and Sybil Jason. Well, do you know there is an international Al Jolson Society? And we have Dave Grime, who is the Southern California representative. Come on up here, Dave. Hello, Richard. Hello, Dave. Tell well, us about the society. The International Al Jolson Society, founded in 1950. There's about a thousand of us strong all over the world. And I know there's a lot of young people out here that love Al Jolson in Nigel this room. You've been dancing all night. Nigel loves it, and he's 22 years old. Hey. That's right, and I'm the Southern Cal rep, about 90 strong here in uh, SoCal. Well, we'd like to put that up over 100, so I know there's some of you out there who would love to know about the society. I'm in the center table over there. Come on over, talk to me. That's right. Dave's the centerpiece at the center table. Go talk to him. And then eat sushi off the <laughs> That's great. Dave Grime from the International Al Jolson Society. That's great. Well, now we're going to do a song, a Jolson song from 1924. This song, and it features Jim Ziegler in the, in the second verse, actually. This is called Never Again. What do you say? That, that. I was blue, used to sigh the whole night through, but now I'm just as happy as can be. Ain't you heard, can't you guess, how I found my happiness? Ain't nothing else but love that happened to me. No, 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 never again will I be lonely. I'm saying never again will I complain to loving eyes like the skies full of sunshine. They smiled away all the rain, waiting till you see them time and again. Down by the river, I'd wander time and again, but those days are through. They say that everybody needs somebody, so did I. Ain't nobody ever gonna hear me sigh. No, no, never again will I be blue. Come on, Jim. Time and again, you 
know what those days are through. One time I laid down on the railroad track to meet my fate. Ha <laughs> ha! Gee, I'm glad the train was two weeks late. I'm saying, never again will I be blue. Thank you, folks. Lizette, darling, Lizette, come here, Lizette. Come on up here, just very briefly. Now, this is my good friend, Lizette. Give her a big hand. Now, there are so many nice young men that would love to come up and dance with her. Where's Johnny Danger and all them crazy legs people? You gotta come and ask this beautiful girl to dance because she knows how to cut a rug. So come on up. Johnny, anybody, come on, let's see. One of these guys over here wants to do. Don't worry. I'm not worried, on I'm, I'm setting you up. It's a fix up. Fix a fix up on the dance floor. She got it. Just all right. sing. Okay, they'll sing and I'll, I'll play. All right. Come on, let's go on down there. And they're, gonna, they're gonna flock to you any second. You won't. No, you will not be alone, I promise. You'll never dance alone. Okay, go on down there. Give her a big hand, folks. Lizette, and come on down here. Where's all those swing dancers that come in here? Come on down and help this lady out. Yeah, just indeed. I'm going to be singing big time. Okay, what's the next song? I have no idea where we are, what we're doing. Yes. Okay, here is the song, uh, uh, the Native American song. Okay, this asks the question, who played poker with Pocahontas? <laughs> so it's... Dun, 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 dun. Carrie, 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 oh, Carrie. Help this. Get ready, folks. It's a novelty song. Looking through my history, I found a little mystery about a certain dame. How did little Pocahontas take John Smith for all his wampus bet? I know her game. He taught her how to play poker. She sent him home without his dough. Every time that he came back, he found her with a larger stack. Here's what I'd like to know. Say, who played poker with Pocahontas when John Smith went away? She always dressed up so pretty. Somebody must have fed the kitty. She wore a blush just like every Indian that led John astray. Poor Johnny's pipe of peace was out the day he quit. When he came back, he found his piece of pipe was lit. So who played poker with Pocahontas when John Smith went away? Cleopat in history, she made a mark of Anthony. Old Anthony, he knew it too. When Napoleon went busted, Josephine was sure disgusted at his Waterloo. Take off your hat to Columbus. He put Queen Isabel in hock. Now all these facts are bona fide, but there's a thing we must decide. And don't think I mean to not. Now listen, folks. Who played poker with Pocahontas when John Smith went away? <laughs> She always dressed up, oh, so pretty, just like a little girl in the city. She wore a blush just like every Indian that led John astray. He called on her one cold night in an awful storm. She had no cold, but still she kept that old wig warm. So who played poker with Pocahontas when John Smith went away? Thank you, folks. That was terrific. Mr. Randy Waltz at the piano. What's that? All right, and now we're going to have a couple of instrumentals from the band, the Blue Serenaders Orchestra. We're going to start with Ain't You Coming Back to Dixieland. All right, a nice Irish song. A nice Irish song. Ain't You Coming Back to Dixieland. All right, boys, what do you say? Take it away.
terrific. Here's another one. This is called Here Comes My Ball and Chain. Wow. Somebody down here is beckoning to somebody up there. So come down. Was she saying no? He's giving out. She's giving in. I know what they're thinking. Hooray for two and maybe three. Hooray for baby and me. Ha -ha. That's next year. All right. All right, this is called Here Comes My Ball and Chain. <laughs>
song was called Here Comes My Vaughn and Shane. <laughs> it's all right. It's okay, Don. <laughs> and now we want you to know, folks, if you go out front, you can take your picture in the moon. Just like Paper Moon, there's a big giant moon out front. Just like they did in the 30s and the 40s and soon, or earlier than that. You can have your photograph taken in the moon, the crescent moon, out there. I think this is the only place that does that anymore. Cicada Club, yeah. And now we're going to bring back to the stage our special guests. You saw them in the last half. They're bringing, we're bringing them back right now. The, the hottest new act in vaudeville. Please welcome once again Evans and Rogers. Hello, darling. How are you, dear? Oh, I'm just doing very well. This is a wonderful evening. And we have such wonderful people here. Oh, and we forgot to say, hello, Sybil. Hello, Sybil. There, Sybil. We miss you, but we're so glad that you can see us there at home. All right, take it away. Let's have some more swell Jolson. on the other side? Go ahead. Okay, we're going to do a medley of Jolson favorites. Oh, Bill. 
<laughs> Keep going, go right ahead. She's yours. <laughs> okay, now here's a song. This is a Jolson song from 1922. Actually, we're gonna have two in a row, one from Ian, one from Ian Whitcomb was coming up. This is, if you were in the newspaper business, this is a song based for you because it's about someone who advertises in the newspaper to get his girl back. All right, it's called Lost, A Wonderful Girl. So it's dun, 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 dun. Mr. Newspaper Man, please help me out if you can. My sweetie wandered away. I fear she may go astray. I've searched for her every place, but I haven't found any trace. I'm feeling awfully bad, so please run this head in your lost and found column today. I've lost, I've lost. A wonderful girl, a beautiful girl. Please help me find her and remind her she is all the world to me. Without her, I don't even care about living. Tell her everything will be forgiven. I would give up all that I own. back home. I'm kind of lost without a lost, a wonderful girl. Want to find the please retain her to me. I have been waiting in vain, hoping to hear once again her sweet voice calling to me. I wonder where she can be My feelings I can't disguise And everyone reads in my eyes They see that I'm all upset Seems I just can't forget There's but one thing to do Advertise I've lost, I've lost, I've lost, I've lost A wonderful girl A beautiful pearl Sally, I'm a rally, Grace, and the beautiful face at making love. This little peach of Reno is 20 years ahead of Valentino. A when, a when, a when she rolls her eyes at the man. Da -da 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 they fall and never get up again. She's just a home destroyer. right now, the amazing, the wonderful, Mr. Ian Whitcomb. Yeah. Come on, Ian, where are you, sir? There you are. You're so there. Those... You're all there. That's where you you're are. Slow, yes. Oh, we're going to do a slow and a fast. Yes. Slow, slow, quick, quick, slow, yes. slow, slow, quick, quick, slow. <laughs> Look at these crazy dancers tonight. Wow. Look at this, oh my God, darling. Don't come up on stage, darling. Oh, don't say no. Don't say no, say oh, yes, I, I want to. Oh, yes. <laughs> yes, look at you, what's your name, dear? Jessica, come on up, Jessica. What would you like to? Stay right there, Max. Okay, what would you like to say to your adoring fans and keep it clean? Um, I love Gianna. Perfect, Dottie, Good thank birthday. you. It's her birthday. My, oh my, it's my birthday now too. <laughs> All right, anyway, yeah, thank you very much, Jessica. Maxwell, would you help me? Thank you, Jessica. Wow. Ian, did you see that? No, I didn't. You old. missed it. I died a long time. You never <laughs> I'm dead. I'm You're not dead. You ready? Yes. Okay, please welcome <laughs> Mr. Ian Whitcomb, ladies and gentlemen.
I've got a very sad song. Oh, this is a banjo you. Yeah. Yeah. Just, thank you. This is a very slow song because I'm a very old person. In fact, I died in 1965. I used to be in rock and roll, but since I met Maxwell, I have renounced rock and roll. Praise the Lord! Here's a lugubrious song. Except Who wants a bad play. little boy? In the house across the street from me Lives a lad as cute as he could be When he's bad, I hear his daddy say Now you be good or I'll give you away From the porch where he has gone to cry You'll hear him shout to every passerby Who wants a bad little boy Who is always in the way who wants a bad little boy Who is not allowed to play With other children just seems like nobody cares Though I tried not to annoy won't you find some lonesome daddy Who would love to live with a little laddie Even though he's a bad little boy Now, tell me who wants a bad little boy I'm asking you, I'm just a little child Who is always, who is always in the way A little boy other children it seems like nobody cares though I tried not to annoy let's take it home or won't you find some lonesome daddy who would love a lonesome laddie even though he's a bad little boy with who wants a bad little boy that's a dirt and you got a, a big fast one coming up yeah. right this is a song Jolson loved this song right all right and Sophie Tucker loved it too all right give it. I'll be down to take you in a taxi honey you better be ready about a half hour stay Oh, baby, don't be late. I want to be there when the band starts playing. Remember when we get there, honey. For two steps, I'm going to have them all. I'm going to wear out both my shoes when they play those jelly roll moves. Tomorrow night at the Doctor's got us ball. Smiling, the whole world smiles with you. When you're laughing, <laughs> when you're laughing, <laughs> the sun comes shining through. But when you're crying, you bring on the rain, so stop that crying. Come on, be happy again. Oh, smiling.
you're crying, when you're crying, you bring on the rain, so stop your crying. Come on, be happy again. When you're smiling, just keep on smiling. Because the whole world smiles with you. Thank you very much. When you're smiling, everybody's smiling tonight. Mr. Halper. I felt I came to, I know I died, but I came back to life. Jolson's spirit came into me. He's standing right underneath Gordon. What? That's a kissing. Give him the <laughs> You got engaged, Al Jolson. Wonderful. <laughs> we'll play at the wedding. Oh, I love it. All right, once again, ladies and gentlemen, the legendary Ian Whitcomb. Come on, let him hear it, folks. He's going to be here next week at the Cicada Club. And now we bring back to the stage Mr. Maxwell DeMille for a very special announcement. Yes, that's right, ladies and gentlemen. This February, I am happy to be involved with the great Los Angeles Air Raid of 1942 there at Fort MacArthur in San Pedro, California. And we have some members of the armed forces from 1942 with us. Come on up, boys, and uh, say hello to the crowd. Hello, men. These are our flyboys, ladies and gentlemen. What's in store for us at Fort MacArthur? A uh, great night of dancing, a uh, great night of uh, military and uh, 40s music to Dean Mora and his orchestra. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. It's Dean Mora and the Fort MacArthur Officers Orchestra as we present a thrilling recreation of the great Los Angeles Air Raid, which actually happened in 1942 in February when Los Angeles was under attack but we don't know what the attack was from. Was it the enemy? Was it a blimp? Was it a flying saucer with men from Mars? We don't know. But we'll see you both at Fort MacArthur in February. Thank you. And now, ladies and gentlemen, a tradition here at the Cicada Club, a special dance for those folks in the audience tonight who are celebrating a birthday. If it's your birthday, step on down to the dance floor for a very special dance. No experience necessary. Yes. So step right out on the dance floor. It's your birthday. And we're going to play a special song for your birthday dance. It's, it's your birthday. What's your name, miss? Lisa. Who else is having a birthday? Right here. What's your name? Crystal. Oh, I see. A boy's name, Crystal. Very nice. Oh, Russell. Russell. And what's your name, miss? What? D drama? Oh, Gianna. Yes, I, I saw it. And you have something to announce. Yes, we do. We have two people who are not with us. Of course, Sybil Jason is celebrating her birthday tomorrow night. And our good friend, Corey Lejeune, who's watching all the way from Maine. Hello, Maine. He lives between Collinsport and Bangor. That's where he lives in Maine. So he's celebrating his birthday too. So he's gonna join the birthday dance with us, as is Sybil from home. He'll be dancing psychically. And now, ladies and gentlemen, it's time for the birthday dance. Take it away, Blue Serenaders. And the birthday song is Blues My Naughty Sweetie Gives to Me. <gasps> Chorus only. Right, blues, my naughty sweetie gives to me. That, that's a, that sounds scandalous, Maxwell. Yeah. All right, yes. you ready? Go. Here we are, your fabulous birthday dance. <laughs>
Jim Garofalo on the bass. Birthday dance, ladies and gentlemen, and now don't leave the dance floor because we must sing happy birthday to you. And here's Mr. Halpern to sing happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday from Club Cicada to all of you and Sybil and Corey. It's his birthday tomorrow. To happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, everybody. And of course, as is our tradition here at the Cicada Club, if it's your birthday, raise your hand if you're on the floor. You and you. Okay. Step right into the center of the floor, ladies and gentlemen, if it's your birthday. Yes, because it's time, ladies and gentlemen, as we do each and every birthday dance, the traditional birthday spanking, ladies and gentlemen. Which means you each get a little spank from Richard Alburn because it means he likes you. Oh, well, here's someone that's... Uh, are you sure it's your birthday or did you just want Richard to spank you? Yes, and who says you don't get your money's worth here at the Cicada? Well, wait a minute. Oh, wait, Richard, you forgot someone on the left here. He wants a birthday spanking from Richard. Okay, that's very nice. Anybody else like a birthday spanking? Okay, let's not get carried away. Make sure it actually is her birthday. A lucky birthday spanking. And we'll see you next year all you folks for another bigger and better birthday spanking here at the Cicada Club. And of course, we're spanking them in spirit, the folks watching on the webcam. And you folks watching our broadcast, you can just spank yourselves. Okay. Boy, we've just denigrate, right, disintegrated right into the trash. I love it. Crash into hell in a wheelbarrow on this stage. <laughs> And folks, watch out for the strawberries on the floor. They are deadly and lethal, as you can see. <laughs> okay. All right, who, who's here from Kentucky? Raise your hand. Who, oh, one person, nobody. Well, yeah, well, this song is for you then. Hey, wait a minute, your birthday, you get yourself out on this dance. Oh, here we go, she already did come down. It's all right. This is a song about Kentucky. It's an Al Jolson song. I believe it's uh, 1925 or 24. You got the Roman numerals. 24. It's called Hello Tucky, and it's like this. Like all Kentucky boys, longing for the city's choice, I left the farm and started to roam. Like all Kentucky boys, sick of all the city noise, I heard Kentucky calling me home. Any thrill you get when you are leaving, doesn't touch the thrill when you return. You're saying hello, Tucky, Tucky, hello. Hello, Tucky, why did I go? What I've been through to get to you. And now I found you. Let me put my arms around you. Shady bowers, valleys and hills. Birdies, flowers, nothing but 
but thrills. I'm glad I went astray to get that kick of saying, Hello, Tucky, hello. Hello, Tucky, 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 hello. Hello, Tucky, oh, why did I go? What I've been through to get to you. Now I've found you, let me put my arms around you. Shady, shady powers, valleys and hills. Birdies, flowers, nothing but thrills. I'm glad I went astray to get that kick of saying, Hello, Tucky, hello. Hello, Tucky. Right on. Wow. Tucky, Tucky, hello, that's great. Felicity, are you from Kentucky? <laughs> Felicity, are you from Kentucky? Just say yes anyway. Well, then that song is dedicated to you. <laughs> All right, and now we're gonna bring back to the stage our good friend who's from Florida. He's the sunshine boy, 22 years old, and loves the music of Al Jolson. Please welcome back Mr. Nigel Dreiner. How are you, sir? Thank Having you. a good Thank time? You. Wonderful time. I have a feeling it's going to be one of those hot nights. Yes, indeed. Uh -huh. Charleston, where we make two columns, and we have Laura Brody, and is going to help me with that. Uh, so this song is called, Was That the Human Thing to Do? That's a Rudy Valley song, but Jolson loved that song. He was good friends with Rudy Valley. So it's, uh, Was That the Human Thing to Do? And then we're going to go into the Charleston, all right? So let's get ready.
the human thing to do. Hello, darling. Are you ready for the Charleston? Are you all ready? Johnny, come on up here, Johnny Rogart. Johnny Danger, everybody. He just turned 20 and loves this music. They're getting younger and younger. I sure do. We're going to play it. Richard Halpern, Edison Records. That's right. It's been done. <laughs> Don't leave. We're doing the Charleston, all right? Rusty Frank, did you bring everyone downstairs from the... Tra Listen, you guys upstairs, you want to come to... You don't want to miss this. Trust me. Come on down for this Charleston right now. Honestly. It's the big dance of the night. Okay, bring more of them. <laughs> okay. All right, we're going to do the Charleston, and then in the middle of the song, we form a big row in the middle of the, uh, uh, middle of the aisle, and you face your partner on opposite sides of the row. So, Rusty, you want to show us how to do it? You and... All right, so if you're dancing together, pretend you're dancing together, pretend you're dancing together, and then in the middle of the number, you go to opposite sides of the dance floor. No, you know how to... And then you promenade down the center, like Soul Train, which is the only reference I can give, even that it's not a 1920s reference. So, Laura, you know what this is. All right, so everybody start off by dancing with each other, and then in the middle, at the... Yeah, let's do it. Thank you. Thank you. All right. All right. Let's everyone get together, and we're going to start it, and then we'll separate. Ready? Go. Charleston, everybody. What do you say? Two, one, two, three. Da, 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 da.
that's beautiful, that's Charleston, everybody. I think you guys did marvelously. What do you think, Laura, huh? Terrific. What do you think, Maxwell? Say, folks, let's hear it for Richard Halpern's Hollywood Cavalcade. And how about a big round of applause for the Blue Serenaders Dance Orchestra. Let's introduce the band, shall we? We've got Mr. Jim Ziegler on the trumpet cornet thing. <laughs> Mr. Daniel Glass on the drums. Jim Garofalo on the bass. John Reynolds on the banjo and the guitar. And Mr. Randy Waltz conducting and the piano. And let's have a hand for our special guest. Here he is, Nigel Dreiner, the Sunshine Boys. Stay right here. Nigel, you're going to come back and visit us again? I will indeed. Thank you. You got it. Stay here. And also, Evans and Rogers. Bring them on stage. Evans and Rogers. Well, there's Rogers. Where's Evans? She's around. Well, she's in the last number, so she better come. And Ian Whitcomb. Here is that Sharon. Ian Whitcomb, everybody. Where is Ian Whitcomb? Come on down, Ian. He may not be here anymore. I'm not sure. Really? I'm not sure. Well, Ian, if you're here, just come up in this song. All right. Now, how many of you have been to Hawaii? Wow. Well, if you have gone, you're going back right now. If you haven't gone, you're going right now with us. Wow, is that what they do in Hawaii? That was King Kamehameha? Thank you, Rick. <laughs> it was the what? That was the steamship whistle saying it's time to depart to Hawaii. Yes, indeed. Okay. <laughs> all right, well, hopefully Ian will come up. But, but, all, right. all right, what do you say, boys? Let's go to Hawaii. <laughs> up your troubles, come on along, where lights are dreamy and life's a song, in Honolulu across the sea, making wicky wacky down at Waikiki, the hula dancers are sure good news, those joy dispensers are cure for blues, it's absolutely the place to be, making wicky wacky down at Waikiki, no evening clothes, anything goes, believe it or not, and when the night shadows fall, that's when they're all the ukulele, they use the moonbeams to light the night. And every tune seems to sound just right. It's absolutely the place to be, making wicky wacky down in Waikiki. Come with me, all you whoopie makers, all you wide awakers, join me. Oh boy, I just found a spot. Ha, you're gonna like it a lot. And it's far away, off in Honolulu, where the hula hula greets you. Hawaii is the place. You wouldn't blame me if you could be making wicky wacky down at Waikiki. You get a feeling of pure delight. Your head is reeling, your heart is light. Your eyes are dancing with revelry, making wicky wacky down at Waikiki. You never saw dresses of straw like they wear it there. And all those dances they do, there's nothing you can compare. What a revelation, Hawaiian cuties with goo goo eyes. And all they beauties, oh, you'd be surprised. You're never lonesome for company. Making wicky wacky down in Waikiki. Come on, boys!
Come back next month and see us again. Come on, Max. Ladies and gentlemen, you've been enjoying Richard Alman's Hollywood Cavalcade with the Blue Serenaders Orchestra here at the Cicada Club. We hope to see you next week for Ian Whitcomb and his Buffalo Boys. So for now, this is Maxwell DeMille wishing you all the best of good luck and good evening.